G'day, Sambo here. It's about 3 p.m. Saturday, 26th of December 2015. Not a very good day for solar, especially compared to yesterday. So, when the sun's not shining, that's a good opportunity to work on the solar system. There's my two 300 watt panels there. I'm here under the carport. This is my backup system now. Um, I've just got the fridge running off of that. Um, Christmas morning, Mum came down and turned the inverter off. When she got down here, this voltage was reading four down and a half volts. And I think that's because of that cheap charge controller. Um, this afternoon, I might get around to replacing that. 120 amp hour battery that will run my house fine at 1000 watt inverter unless I want to pump water and wash clothes at the same time but anyway let's go into the house and see what I've spent the last few hours fixing up so this conduit here that's coming in from the solar panels into the side of the distribution board there's the circuit breaker for it. Up to the kid charge controller. Power comes back down. Another 20 amp miniature circuit breaker. Out. Up and over. And down to the batteries. Then I've got 35 millimeter square cable comes from the batteries. Got my fuse block there. into the 24 volt to 240 volt inverter at the moment I've just got that going to a power board and my kilowatt meter in the next few months I'll get a new distribution board put in in the main meter box and I'll run power from there I've got some plans to keep the wiring nice and tidy so let's kick this in Kid self testing. Turn the PV on. There we go, that click, it's just t turning itself on. 26 volts, 56 watts. That's a rainy, shitty afternoon. I'm not surprised that that's all the power I'm getting. 2.2 amps. So, anyway. There's an update on the 600 watt solar, solar power system. I'll talk to you in another video.